All right. Here on the lake, it's a little choppy. Let's tilt that a little bit. There we go. How's that looking? It's quite the waves coming in. Uh, probably about three feet, but some of the swells are dipping six to seven feet quite easily. But the camera doesn't do it justice. Uh, but if I just sit here, there's a couple of big ones coming in now. So I'll have a little move up there. Right, heading south. Point Avenue Lighthouse is just over there. A big one. Holy moly! Oh. <laughs> Woo! Another of a big one. So that's a six footer. Easily. Oh, there's a few more coming in now. There's another six footer right there. Right? Well, maybe not. Still got me though. That one is. Right, I'm right at the cross here where the, the waves are going left and right. Due to the shallow water being by the lighthouse here, yeah, there's a couple of big ones now. Yeah, there's a big swell, right down and up and down. There's a couple of big ones. Oh shit! <laughs> oh! Wow! Another one! There's a big one! Thankfully it went the other way. See what I mean? They're kind of like splitting a little bit. It's just where, where I'm positioned, I think. There's a big swell right there, right there, look at that. Now this just shows how badly Lake Erie and how rough it can get really quick. Uh, yesterday, and the day before, well, yesterday, oh, that's a big one. Yesterday, whee, uh, the water was like glass. And look at it now. Uh, small craft advisory, there's no boats out today. I'm the only person out here. Uh, strategically, I'm going to a certain position knowing if I have an engine failure, the current and the winds are just going to push me back to shore and into the bay. See, I'm not going to go past. I'm not going to go past this because it's not worth it. But here, the winds and the currents will just push me straight down that way. Worst case scenario, which is about four kilometers away. Give you an angle of what it looks like from this side now. Whoa. Way out there. I'm not chasing that today. It's too rough. 